Hi guys. And I know it's been a while since we did our last um, food video. Um, but this morning we're going to take a look at Morningstar Farms bacon strips. Veggie breakfast bacon strips. Yay. So how do you feel? Good. Um, well, I mean the last thing that we tried from Morningstar was really good. Yeah. And um, I'm just not sure that from the photo on this package that this is going to live up to the same reputation that uh, Benevolent Bacon had from Sweet Earth. Yeah, these look... The uh, photo looks weird. Yeah, they look um, a bit more like bacon than the Benevolent uh, Bacon did, but... The, uh, we'll see. the photos on the website also look, the bacon looks really fake, so. Oh, okay. Well, I guess, you know, taste is kind of 90% of it, so. Mm, let's Ooh, that looks interesting. Cooking instructions. In a non-stick skillet over medium heat. Place strips in skillet and heat 8 to 10 minutes, turning occasionally or until crisp. And it says nothing about oil, so we will not use oil. Medium heat. Let that heat up for a second. Yeah, you can always use a tiny bit of oil, just in case. I, I, well, I don't want to do anything that, you know, the instructions don't say to do yet. Yeah. Just do it. Let's see. Frost in the package. Hmm. Well, they certainly give you a good amount of them. Yeah, they do. Oh, they're already soft right out of the package. Let me get the frost off, off but. Yeah. Flip it over. Oh, wow. I saw that. It, well, looks kind of like, you know, your standard packet of bacon here in America. It does. They're so light. They're yeah. super light. Like, you know you're not handling bacon. It smells smoky, though. Even uncooked, okay. it smells smoky. Well, that's what we want. Uh, the edges are, are squared off, which is not like, typical. But again, we all know we're not dealing with real bacon. Mm-hmm. They don't look unpleasant. No, they don't look unpleasant. And they smell pleasant. So, and they're pretty flexible. Huh? They're, I don't want to mishandle them while they're, I'll leave yeah. one to thaw. I'll take the box there when you get started and just to show up and give people a closer look. Okay. The great thing about these are no cholesterol and very low in calories compared to actual bacon. Mm-hmm. So that's good. So the 100% vegetarian. Let's take a look around the box here. The pan is ready. So, I'm not sure we're going to get a sizzle off these. Well, we'll probably get a sizzle from the frost. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Oh, here we go. And do they stick? No. No. It doesn't look like it's gonna stick. Wow, they sound amazing. They sound well, yeah, like yeah, but bacon. it's. I mean, it's it's frost. Yeah. It's the frost that's. Oh, and they're not sticking at all, which is good. I don't smell anything yet. I smell a Ooh, little bit, yeah. There it goes. That's a bacony smell. Ooh. Hey, they're uh, frosting quite nicely. That is a bacony smell. It is. 
very pleasant. And there's what looks like fat. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, yeah. touch, I'm gonna touch the food. Yeah, that's fat. That is definitely like a fatty. But it must be like a vegetable oil based yeah, fat. Yeah, vegetable oil based fat. But definitely a fat. So, I mean, they definitely remembered to put in, you know, a type of. Oh, and it's rippling. It's starting to ripple. Yeah, look at that. Okay, I may be wrong. Yeah, That's, these these oh, definitely look a lot more baconish than benevol benevolent bacon, but we'll see in the taste, they smell like bacon. Oh, starting wow, to brown, yeah. That Ooh. really smells like bacon. These are acting like bacon. How did they do that? I don't know. Are these I'll bet I'll bet these I'll bet these these pale strips are yeah. like a fat, a vegetable type fat. Okay. Strip. Now when it says vegetarian, does that mean vegan as well? It should be. No, no, it's not vegan. Has uh, it does have egg whites? Okay. So vegetarian, but not vegan. So vegetarian, not vegan. Remember that, guys. And it does have milk in it. Okay. For, for those of you who are, uh, for those of you who are lactose um, intolerant, or animal or meat protein or intolerant, or meat protein intolerant. Um, these are probably not for you. Yeah, be careful. Make sure always to read the back of the box if, if you're in doubt. What, these, yeah, they really curl up, don't they? They do. Look at that sizzling away, just like bacon. It does sound now that the now that the frost is gone. It sounds like bacon. It does, and it smells like bacon. Yeah, get get in close there, and I'll shut up for a minute. Look at those sizzle. Definitely a lot healthier. Oh yeah, definitely. Wow. First, physically and the environment to use these over real bacon. So. I hear hissing. Yeah. Look at those. Just look at that. And they're browning up just like bacon. That really smells like bacon. It's incredible. Oh, a morning star may have another hit for me. They might. Wow. If this is the way my bacon is going to turn out, I'll be buying boxes and boxes of oh, stuff. Oh, yeah. I happily, I mean, if it tastes like bacon or some bit close, definitely. Because real bacon is, is really bad for us in so many ways. Four, so put it on for another. It says do not overcook, but I, I've never cooked these before, so. Yeah, we don't know what, I mean, what's overcooked. I know what regular bacon is, but yeah. this. This isn't acting completely like regular bacon. It's starting to get smoky. I'm going to turn the heat down. But aren't they supposed to go crispy like, like American bacon? It's supposed bacon? to go crispy, but remember, we're still dealing with a vegetable strip, so I don't want to burn it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they're... Oh, they're done. Yeah. Uh, well, they're going to have to be. They're starting to burn now. Okay. Okay. There we go. That didn't take very long. No, not Maybe at all. I had the heat too hot. And here you can see the uncooked ones next to the cooked ones. Yeah, and here's a um, an uncooked one that's defrosted. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can. Yeah. You really have to put pressure on it to make it break. Yeah. You really have to put a lot of pressure on it. And it's still. Yeah. It's That's good. Tough. It's yeah. a, these are tough little strips. Alright. Whoa, that really smells okay. like bacon. Okay, let's go. So, yeah. That's, it's oh, crispy. That's crispy, yeah? It's crispy. Have a taste. Okay. It smells, it smells like bacon. Ooh, that's really crunchy. Mmm. 
It's not fatty like bacon, but it has that saltiness to it. It's not very smoky, but it is like salty and crispy and mm, almost like a garlic tanginess. Okay. Yeah, the oven agrees too. It's ready. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is really delicious. Oh, you got to try this. Okay, I'll give it a go. Yeah. Why don't you move over where I was? And... Okay. I'm going to take a piece here. Oh, that's really crunchy. That looks like bacon fat. I mean, this part here. Mmm. That's really crunchy. And that saltiness. <laughs> I know. It's, it's like you want to keep putting pieces in your mouth just like bacon. Yeah. And I could totally use this for casseroles oh, and yeah. quiche. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a oh, hit with oh, me. Yeah, it's got that saltiness. It's a hit with it's, me. It's better. I think it's better than the benevolent bacon. Oh, big time. It's actually like bacon. They're about 97% there. Yeah. But Remember, it's not vegan. This is vegetarian, but not vegan. So. Yeah, definitely. So, uh, I'm going to cook up some eggs with the rest of this stuff. Man, I'm going to have a good lunch today. Oh, big time. Um, I would, I would happily replace actual bacon with this stuff. In fact, I think we probably will. Absolutely. It's a lot healthier for us, a lot less calories. Did we mention the, the calorie count? Um, yeah, it's on the front of the, of the box. Uh, 60, 60 calories per serving, and a serving size is two strips. So for two of these, 60 calories. That's pretty impressive. That is. That is really impressive. Total fat is four and a half grams, with the with the saturated fat only being a half a gram of that, which is fantastic. Two hundred and thirty milligrams of sodium, um, but we all expect sodium to be high in a, in a in a serving of this type. Yeah. It does have a generous potassium count, fifteen milligrams. Fiber's okay. No no sugar, and Good. two two grams of protein. Good. Right. Excellent. Yep. I like it. Okay, guys. That was our look at Morning Star Farms veggie breakfast bacon strips. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. <laughs>